Alice is very happy to go to London with her family. London is a big city. She never goes to a big city before. She wants to see many things in London. She wants to see a big clock, a big wheel, and a big house. She also wants to eat fish and chips. Fish and chips is a food from Britain. Alice and her family go to London on a sunny day. They take a car from the airport to their hotel. Alice looks out of the window and sees many cars, buses, and bikes on the road. She also sees many people walking on the street. They wear different clothes and speak different languages. Alice thinks that London is a different and fun city. Alice and her family go to their hotel. Then they go to a city party near their hotel. The city party is about London. There are many shops selling food, drinks, gifts, and things. There are also people playing music, dancing, and doing tricks. Alice likes all the things she sees and hears. She wants to see everything, but her parents tell her to stay with them. They say that the city party is very busy and that she can get lost easily. Alice says yes and says she will stay with them. But then Alice sees something she likes very much. It is a shop selling balloons like animals. Alice loves balloons, especially animal balloons. She wants to buy one for herself. She runs to the shop without telling her parents or her brother. She does not see that they stop at another shop to buy some ice cream. She goes to the balloon shop and looks at all the animals. There are dogs, cats, beers, lions, elephants, and more. She asks the seller how much a balloon is. He says that it is two pounds each. Alice has some money in her pocket that her grandma gives her before she leaves. She counts her money and sees that she has enough for one balloon. She picks a balloon like a panda, her favorite animal. The seller smiles and gives her the balloon. He also gives her a string to hold it. Alice says thank you and turns around to go back to her family. But when she looks for them, she does not see them anywhere. She feels scared in her heart. She is lost in the city. Alice is sad. She does not see her family. She is in a new city. There are many people, but she does not know them. She wants to go home. She thinks about her mom, dad, and brother. She hopes they are looking for her. She needs help. She remembers some words in English. Her teacher taught her the words. They are good words to use when you need help. She sees a lady near her. The lady looks nice and friendly. Alice talks to her. She says, Hello, can you help me? The lady stops and looks at Alice. She smiles and says, Yes, what do you need? Alice feels a bit better. She says, I am lost. I do not see my family. The lady says, Oh no, that is bad. How did you get lost? Alice tells her that she ran away from her family to get a balloon. She shows the lady the balloon with a panda on it. The lady says, I understand. Well, do not worry. We will find them. Do you know where you saw them last? Alice thinks and says, They were getting ice cream at a place. The lady says, Okay, let's go there and look for them. She holds Alice's hand and walks with her. Alice goes with her, hoping to see her family soon. Alice and the lady go to the place with ice cream. Alice saw her family there before. They look for them, but they do not see them. Alice is more sad and scared. She says, They are not here. Where are they? 
The lady says, Do not cry, Alice. Maybe they are looking for you in another place. Do you have a phone? Alice says no. She says, I have a balloon and some money. The lady says, Okay. Well, maybe we can use my phone to call them. Do you know their phone number? Alice says yes. She knows their phone number. She tells the lady the number. The lady uses her phone to call the number. She waits. She says, It is ringing. Maybe they will answer. Alice hopes that her mom or dad will answer the phone. Then they hear a voice. It is Alice's mom. She says, Hello, who is this? The lady says, Hello, my name is Sarah. I am with Alice. She is lost at the big party, and I found her. She is okay. Alice's mom is very happy and surprised. She says, Oh my God, thank you so much. Where are you? We are looking for her everywhere. The lady says, We are at the place with ice cream near the big stage. Where are you? Alice's mom says, We are at the place with police near the door. We went there to tell them that Alice is lost. Can you bring her there? The lady says, Yes, we will be there soon. Alice's mom says, Thank you again, Sarah. You are very good. She stops the phone and hugs Alice's dad and brother. She says, They found Alice. She is okay. We have to go and see her. They leave the place with police and run to the place with ice cream. Alice and the lady see them coming. Alice sees them and says, Mom! Dad! Tom! She runs to hug them. They hug her and kiss her. They say, Alice, we are so happy to see you. We were so worried about you. Alice says, I am sorry I left you. I wanted to buy a balloon. She shows them the balloon with a panda on it. They say, It is okay, Alice. We are not mad at you. We are just happy that you are safe. They also say thank you to Sarah for finding Alice and bringing her back to them. They say, Thank you so much, Sarah. You are very nice. Sarah says, You are welcome. I am happy that Alice is with her family again. They say goodbye and thank you to each other. Then they go away. Alice says goodbye to Sarah and says, Bye-bye, Sarah. Thank you for everything. Sarah says goodbye to Alice and says, Bye-bye, Alice. Be careful. Alice smiles and holds her family's hands. They go away from the big party together. They want to go back to their hotel and rest. They had a lot of fun today. They go away from the big party together. They want to go back to their hotel and rest. They had a lot of fun today.